Hello folks, lovely summer's evening up at the duck pond. Way in the background there. Must be a training session going on or something. The kids shouting, screaming, goals going in. Down in the woods, Armadale Thistler training. Look the part boys, great effort. Further on than that was a more sedate pastime. The bowling, I was in the bowling club watching a couple of guys playing. Big Derek Kerr, I'm sure he's a club champion. Finally defeated the lad, 21-14, it was a great game. Enjoyed it. These are a couple of stories, we're just talking today. I got actually got ripped to be a five-year-old today. Five-year-old, got the better of me. But first, I'll play a couple of stories from our friendly Giorgio. Because I got ripped, Giorgio got ripped twice before me. One of the stories with Giorgio, what's the sweet shop, as everybody knows in Armadale. You boy comes in about nine year old, looks up in the corner. Eh, uh, mister, eh, uh, that's where all the sweets called the millions are kept. So Giorgio, he gets a ladder out, wanders across the corner where the wee boy's looking. Wee boy decides to turn down to his left and say, give me an arrow. Giorgio's <laughs> standing in the corner with the ladder. <laughs> Boy points to the bottom left hand corner, give me an arrow. So that was, that was the first one. The next one with Giorgio. I was in the shop there, I seen it at the time. B boy, he's a 10 year old. B boy walks in. Giorgio, can I get change of a pound? Aye, son, neighbor, what do you want? Uh, just earning. Giorgio, 50 pence, two 20s, and a 10. There you go, son. Thanks, Giorgio. B boy thought for a minute, pushed it all back to him and says, give me a pound mixture. <laughs> George is just, just looking at people. <laughs> Give me a pound mix. <laughs> so I was twice George got done, but I got done a cracker a night. Nice family's moved in next to me. Three kids. Don't know what age you are, maybe five, six and seven. So I felt like that. I'm sure it was a wee boy a night, he's six year old. He's walking up the street, this big, this big planky wood. Well, no planky wood, just a bit of wood. I'm trying to be trendy with him, like thinking back to when I was a wee laddie. He says, alright wee man, is that your gun? He went, no, it's a stick. Is <laughs> 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 I'm thinking I'm going to be great pals with this guy. <laughs> is that your gun, son? No, it's a stick. <laughs> yeah, idiot, you probably. <laughs> <laughs> so George, I think that one tops your two stories. <laughs> I don't think the kids didn't play soldiers anymore. No, I was that age running around the bit with sticks with their stent guns. <laughs> oh, well done, me man. That's one up to you. I'm going to have to be sharp with the neighbours, I think. <laughs> there you go, folks. From the duck pond. A wee story, I'm about to watch the deal. Training, no pain, no gain. One of the best lads, gonna get a stick. <laughs>